Always remember, your focus determines your reality. Hello ladies and gentlemen of Middle Earth, it's the Cyber Hobbit here. Got another unboxing for you. Can't from tell from the title, Rivendell Guard's Helmet. Collectibles made by artists of film. That's, that sounds weird. Collectibles made by artists of film. Actually, of the film, anyway. Do a little rundown of the box as usual. Rivendell Guard's Helmet, one fourth scale miniature. I'm not gonna read all that, but you can, you pause the video. I'm not gonna read it because I know people want to see it unboxed first, other than long thing it takes. So yeah, let's get to it. Let's down a little bit more. So I don't remember the other ones having this. This is cool. This is like a little booklet um, that has some um... oh look at that now I know everything I'm missing yeah this is cool yeah this was definitely not in my other uh, boxes although I mean I, I am getting everything on eBay because that's kind of the only place you can can get these things nowadays um and they are all you know listed as new and you know but they've got a picture of the object so obviously the guy who usually sold it is taking it out of the box and taking pictures of it but the reason that so i'm assuming i haven't seen this before is because maybe the other ones haven't been missing it i hope not anyway um or maybe this is like a new thing they did with this version of it so this is a new kind of box that looks you know i guess the Next generation. Um, anyway, um, let's get to un unboxing it still. Got our styrofoam little thing here. The collectibles. Not as much styrofoam noise as some of the last videos. It's like the worst part of the video because it's very loud. Come on. Well, got my silica gel. The always important silica gel. And. See, that's a stand. This is our helmet. Look at that. Pretty cool. So it's not metal. Um, some of the other helmets I've unboxed have all been metal. This is, I guess, like a, a, a I don't even know. I guess like a kind of a resin. I wish it was metal, but hey, they're not all winners. Oh, I'm out of focus. Come on. There we go. So, yeah. I actually have a full scale version of this helmet. So I'll uh, do a comparison here in a second, but uh, this is pretty cool. Stay focused. Come on. So, besides the helmet, obviously, you get. In. This is different. I guess it's a two piece stand. Huh. So I guess that just goes right on there. Oh, this is rubber. Interesting. Okay, well, they're improving on the quality of things. All the other ones, this part is not rubber. This is like a. Uh, I don't really know. I mean, well, yeah. So, 
this is very similar. This is the the stand of the uh, wow. And so they're about the same weight. Yeah, I think the same weight. Um, I think this is maybe a little smaller. Um, but yeah, this top part is not. Oh, okay. It is rubber too. I just never noticed. It is a little bit smaller though. Um, I just never noticed that that was rubber. I thought it was just like a hard piece of plastic. All right. Anyway. So yeah. Um. Let's uh. Put it on there. There we go. So yeah, um, give me one second and I'm going to get my uh, full size and we can do a comparison. All right, so this is the full size version and this is the four scale. Can I get them both in frame? So yeah, um, this uh, is a piece from United Cutlery. So made by a different company, though United Cutlery, I believe, used. Whoa, okay, camera falling over. Uh, United Cutlery used um, the official props from Weta to make their pieces. So I mean, yeah, it's very accurate. The even the kind of tip here has like a little emblem that they have on. Uh, this one that it's I can get in focus camera. It's kind of hard to see, but okay. it is there though, that little yeah there. So yeah, this is um really cool. Um the only thing I would say is I wish it was metal. Um, this is actually uh, not metal. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Pretty cool. And, um, so, uh, yeah. Very cool. I'm very happy. Maybe it, yeah, it's a little hard to balance too. I guess because it, since it's not metal, it doesn't weigh as much. So since it, it you know, it, it kind of wants to do a little bit more wiggly head bobble thing than otherwise. But, you know, compared to, <laughs> it's kind of funny. Like, so this one, you know, it's it's metal. Sorry, this is actually this is a better example. So this one is metal, and the stand that it has is not very stable, so it actually can just kind of fall off pretty easily. But oh, come on. like yeah, like for example. <laughs> but um yeah, very cool. Very happy. The Rivendell Guards Helmet. One fourth scale. And that's it. So, uh, yeah. By the way, guys, um, hope you are enjoying the channel so far. I'm trying to learn from all my videos and try to do them a little better than the next one. So this version's in 4K. Uh, hopefully it sounds better. Turned off the air conditioner. <laughs> and uh, 
If you like this video, like and subscribe. I'm gonna be doing more. Got a whole lot more things coming that I'm gonna be unboxing. Um, and uh, yeah, stay tuned. Bye.